And he visit. asked me if he could see my Why baby. Why would I take care of a baby that's not mine? Why would I visit a baby that's not mine? I right. My Come baby. on, now. Why would you deny a pretty baby? I, I don't care about How, what? the baby being pretty. I care about, about, about the baby mine or not. Oh, yeah. Your boy back with another video. Y'all see what time it is. I know it's been a while since I reacted to Paternity Court, but it is what it is, man. I got tired of seeing the same videos and feeling like I was saying the same thing over and over and over. So I just had to take a little break and switch it up. But y'all see what it is, man. Let's go. Ms. Sanders, you admit to having another man sign your six-month-old son Caleb's birth certificate, but now say that Caleb's mm. real biological father is the defendant, Mr. Jamarvis Brady. Yes, Sean. You've petitioned the court for a DNA test to prove that so Mr. What Brady was it? is your son. Did you really think the other dude was the father or did you know that he was the father the whole time? But you really didn't like him that much, so you tried to trap the other dude. But we're going to see what she said. Father. Yes, Sean. Mr. Brady, you claim it is genetically impossible that you are Caleb's father and therefore the plaintiff needs to get her child expenses from her son's real dad. Yes, Your Honor, I do. So, Ms. Sanders, what has Mr. Brady done exactly for baby Caleb since his birth? Uh, he has not done anything, hey, Your Honor. Um, I don't blame I him. Caleb, baby fool. I if I don't think it's my kid, then why should I be doing anything for the kid? You know what I'm saying? I ain't mad at him. Get him diapers, clothes, everything. Your and Honor, that is not that. cheap. Does he visit the baby? I came that's, through the neighborhood one that's day. That's why. And he visit. asked me if he could see my baby. I take care of a baby that's not mine. Why would I visit a baby that's not mine? I right. Come on, now. Huh? What? Oh wow! Amazing. Do y'all hear that? How can you deny your pretty baby? So because the baby's pretty, he's supposed to take care of the baby, even though it might not be his. Right. Why do you doubt this beautiful baby is? Y'all see, she ignored that. The first thing is the green eyes. No one in my family has green eyes. May I show you my your honor? Yes. <laughs> Starting with my grandparents. My grandma yeah. don't have brown eye, green eyes. My hey. granddad don't got I ain't even gonna lie. I already believe old dude, man. Then y'all heard what they said at the beginning of the episode. She already had some other dude sign the birth certificate. Now she over here trying to make this dude take care of the baby. Green eyes. My mama or my daddy. Her either, obviously. Me, I definitely don't have brown, green eyes. I'm trying to figure out where these green eyes come, come from. Come on, no. Baby. Yeah. And the baby is really light skinned. Like he's dark skinned, then she's brown skinned. Where'd this baby get this skin color from? And I know some of y'all gonna say, oh, when, when they young, they be one color, then they grow. I, I know all that. I got kids. But this kid or this baby is not a couple weeks old or a couple months old. So at this point, this is the color that she's probably gonna be, bro. Seriously? Like all the time. Like what do you mean? Explain. When Let's I go. first came and found out about the baby, I didn't find out but on um, through Catherine, I found out through a friend who seen it on Facebook. Wow. And I popped up at the house. I ain't called, I ain't text, none of that. I just popped up. And we see what type she is, just despicable. Old dude didn't want nothing to do with her, so now she's like, all right, let me go ahead, try to see if I can put the baby on him. And then if he ends up not being the father, she's going to move on to a third dude. She really don't even know who the father is. She finally came to the door. She said, Caleb don't need you in his life. So you're saying she didn't even inform you that she was pregnant? She told me in the beginning. In the beginning? Yes. Yeah. But then when is this time you had to pop up at the house? This was after the baby was born. Okay, so when she told you she was pregnant, why and didn't you go to an appointment? I tried. Participate. I initially tried to go to the appointment, John. Like, I tried a lot. No okay. good. Catherine's just a handful. Man. He was me from love because I didn't want to be with him no more. So he got mad because I didn't nah. We know that's a lie. Really? Nah, did she say he was mad because she got back with her ex? No, you was acting funny because you got back with your ex and you ain't think you needed him anymore. So he was like, sure, I ain't tripping. I ain't really like you like that anyway. So 
He moved on. And then when it didn't work out with your ex, you tried to come back around to him. Y'all let me know if y'all feel like I'm tripping in the comments. He said he don't want me, but he constantly takes my phone. Somebody said, what's up? I come to the house, dude. Because he know you easy. You ain't gonna get mad and try to fight, bro. Do y'all hear her? So he's lying because he didn't fight the dude. Not all dudes react like that. Some dudes have a little bit of sense and they like, I'm not about to fight over no female. Especially over a female that looked like you. You know old dude really didn't like her like that. And you thought he was about to fight over you, man. Knock it off. No. Bro, she said communication. <laughs> you did? Yes, ma'am. No, he has not. When you Man. say you initially tried, did you succeed? Did you actually help? I don't believe one word she's saying at this point. Just from the way the episode started off, when they said she put somebody else on the birth certificate, then everything she's been saying so far has been a bunch of BS. Probably because you was doing all types of drugs and doing all types of stuff you know you wasn't supposed to do while you was pregnant, but now you want to see her act like you was so sad and was so worried about your son. You're okay. Amazing. But like his heart rate dropped from like 140 down to 70, so I had to hurry up and push him out. I pushed him out in about four minutes. He was my water broke at 9:56. He wanted 10 on the diet, and his umbilical cord was wrapped around his neck and everything. It was a rough pregnancy, and Mr. Brady was never there. Wow, that is, that was, I'm so glad everything turned out fine. Mr. Brady, yeah, I gotta I, ask you, she's going through a lot here. Why weren't you there? Your Honor, she, I, when I tried to take care of him and all that, she told me she didn't need my help. And plus, why would I take care of a baby that's not possibly Bro. mine? But, like, why, why she keep ignoring that part, though? Like, you really gonna ask him this again? Like, you don't understand that? Come on, bro. She playing stupid today. When I was pregnant, he never even cared. I don't think he cared about what's some shoes. When I first told him that I was pregnant, I called Mr. Brady and I told him, I said, I'm pregnant. I want to let you know. He just sat on the phone, didn't say anything. I said, hello, hello. Anna, she, she let another the man whole sign time, birth Yes, I did let another man sign a birth certificate, but the when I first told him I was pregnant, when the doctor told me the times, and when I was with him, I had a cycle. But when me and him broke up, I didn't have a cycle. Anymore. So I told him, and she looked like she about to start smiling. <laughs> Bro, dude, look at all this deflection. She really did not answer his question, said a bunch of nothing. This man asked you a simple question. Why would you put this other dude's name on the birth certificate? And we over here talking about some shoes. Y'all hear how she, so y'all hear how she tried to make herself sound like a good person. Why would I put a baby on, on somebody that can't do it? Oh my God, she is full of shit. No, see, she probably told old dude that he was the father, and that's why the ex, you know what I'm saying, tried to work it out with her again, 
But she was playing both of them, having both of them think they got a kid on the way. And then she chose the ex over him, and that didn't work out, and then she moved on to him. That's what happened, bro. You tested another man. Yes. You found out that he was not the father. Yes. Come on, bro. And after you got back. What more do we need to know about her? They start off the video telling us that she put another man's name on the birth certificate. Then we find out that you tested this other dude and found out that he wasn't the father. That lets us know how loose you are, which proves what I was just saying a few minutes ago, bro. She really don't know who the father is, bro. She just guessing at this point. The ex, that was the dude who she really wanted to be the father. Now everybody who she tested after that, she just like, you know, it don't even matter. I just want to get some child support. Yeah, okay. Sure that the baby's mine. And I bet. Right. I've been told him that I was pregnant. He never cared. Let me see the birth certificate, sir. <sighs> she is really over yes, here. There is in fact Gaslighting the whole curse. Gaslighting this whole damn courtroom. Right. Been an integral part of this child's life we, I told y'all why. Well, let's see what law she about to come up with now. I just didn't want my son to not have someone listed as his father on the birth certificate. It was just something that was inside me instead of just having it blank. And this man was what? going to be in his life like he said he would. I just wanted you man. to know even if this is not your biological father, he still wants to be your father. But he what about when she was life. texting him? When she was texting the dude at work, my co-worker. He comes, I, I don't understand why he keeps saying his co-worker when I was, he never had a job. So what co-worker no, is he talking about? Wow. <laughs> Nine months consecutive. Nine months. Nine months, bro. How old is he? Come on, bro. <laughs> He said nine months could say like that's the longest he ever worked in his life. That is sad. <laughs> and my son six months and I was pregnant. You have to be pregnant for nine months, right? And Caleb is six months. They I don't mean, add up. School for nine months. Yo. So okay, so what month was I testing this man? If you had to be pregnant for nine months, then Caleb is six months. So that's fourteen months. So you saying you had a job for nine months? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And she was texting the coworker. Yes. Okay. When was she texting this coworker? Who was on the line one day? I use his phone to call someone. A number comes through, which is Miss Sanders' mm. phone number. I don't man, know. Man, ain't it funny how so stuff works? I, I bet he's not lying about that, bro. That's how stuff go, bro. And he'd be like, damn. Y'all know what they say. God works in mysterious ways. Window of conception, so you believe she was also sleeping with your co-worker when she was sleeping with you? Yes, ma'am, I do. That's impossible. So you telling me that you seen me text somebody up, but you didn't get mad? Oh. You call, I you call somebody, which one was the caller? No, I don't get mad about it. I don't get mad. Right, why she keep saying this? Bro, and the judge is not checking it, bro. That's why I say she on some BS today. Sometimes she try to be fair, but clearly that's not what's about to happen today. Because old girl keep making the same point, and this junk makes no damn sense. She really act like a dude supposed to fight over her. Or everything he's saying is a lie just because he ain't fight or get mad and go off over you. Come on, man. Everybody don't respond the same way. And she know this. Over here gaslighting us. Of course she don't say no. That's what you doing. Who is this? Let's get to if these results, me, man. Your daughter said to you that there are no other possibilities. You've asked her. Honestly, you only know I have not asked her because man. she said to me that if that he is the only other potential. So did I go in and go behind her and say, Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? No. She said he was one potential and the other. Well, she well you need to the way she out here moving. If she was wrong with the first one, why would you just believe that she knows what she's talking about on the second one? I hope. As good as my child. Come on now. My little man. Both brown eyes. Well, and they got a blue eye baby. Whatever his dad is. Oh, wow. Yeah, he do it. He's standing right there. Just because your eyes don't look. He's not in the middle of 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 the
know, talking. This is basically like the first time I've seen him in months. After he embarrassed me in front of everybody, I have not had no dinner with him at all. Mm. You say he embarrassed you. He embarrassed you. Too. Yes, one day I walked through the neighborhood, he asked. He was like. But she ain't never embarrassed him. Come on, we already know how it go. Just caught my name out the blue. So, I'm like, okay, here we go with this mess again. He said, can I see the baby? I said, yeah. I lift yeah. the um, blanket off his head. Here he go. I told y'all that's not my baby. Y'all look, this is not my baby. Look at his eye, that's not my baby. Well, it'd be nice if somebody else knew besides me. <laughs> Lord, please. This, so, he did this out in public in yes. front of people? in front of everybody, calling his friends over. Like he somebody just got to know besides me. Yeah, that, he doing way too much, bro. You ain't have to put her on the spot like that. Unless it's something that she did and you was like, you know what? She did me like this. She ain't care about putting her business out there. So let me go ahead and defend myself. But this don't seem like one of those situations. It seemed like he just did this because he was in his feelings about everybody saying he had a baby by her. And he wanted to prove to all his friends, like, man, look, this ain't my baby, you know what I'm saying? But like I said, he ain't had to do all that. That wasn't right. That, that is the reason why we're here today. But, sir, listen. At this point, whether they think it's your baby or not has no bearing on the DNA. If, in fact, this child Let's go, is bro. your child, the baby's here, and you got a job. You said it a thousand times. So he's here. Would it? All right, y'all let me know what y'all think. I'm going to go ahead and say he's not the father, bro, but it's always a chance, y'all know. But even if he end up being the father, bro, that don't mean nothing. Y'all know she do not know who the damn father is. It's clear from just hearing this little 10, 15 minutes that we just heard. But let's get it. You already knew that was about to happen. Mr. Brady. I'm gonna hope he's not the father, bro. You. Are not. I told you. I told you. Yeah. Stand right where you're standing. I told you, huh? Yeah. I know it, man. 100% positive. Now let's see what she gonna say to her. Sometimes she'll go in, but today, y'all see what she been on. She been let her get away with any and everything today, so let's see. Miss Sanders, he said he was positive. So who the I don't understand. Positive? I don't, I don't understand. understand. Man, knock it off. So it's not I don't your understand. It's not his. It was no one else. I it was no one else. <laughs> it was no one else. It was no one else. <laughs> it was no one else. She can't even say it with it. Look at her. She's trying not to smile, bro. She's trying so hard to look sad. <laughs> hey, man, y'all let me know what y'all think about this video in the comments. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, your boy, y'all.